It was not by chance that this struggle came to be. The blame falls squarely upon my shoulders for giving evil the chance it needed, and therefore fulfilling an ancient prophecy. Raiden's Earthrealm champions had failed to stop the deadly alliance from fully resurrecting the mummified army of the Dragon King. In the end, only Raiden himself stood between Earthrealm and total destruction. Defying the Elder God's wishes, he alone challenged Quan Chi and Shang Tsung in mortal combat. Earthrealm's last hope for freedom. Raiden fought well against the two sorcerers, and it seemed as though victory was at hand. But the combined might of Quan Chi and Shang Tsung proved to be overwhelming, even for a Thunder God. Raiden was defeated. The Deadly Alliance had won. Their victory was short-lived. As suspicion and lust for power overcame both Quan Chi and Shang Tsung, the former allies turned on each other. The deadly alliance was no more. defeated Shang Tsung and reveled in his conquest. But it is said that there is only one true ruler of Outworld. And that ruler had returned. Filled. The Dragon King had indeed returned to Outworld to reclaim his army and impose his dominance. Death awaited all who stood in his way. was formed out of desperation. Sworn enemies join forces to combat a greater threat. Raiden began to realize that even their combined might was not enough to defeat the Dragon King. Only one chance left. Raiden's sacrifice was in vain, for the blast had little effect on the Dragon King. Now Onaga has what he needs to shape the realms as he sees fit. I was the fool who brought him this power. Only I can destroy this threat, born of deception.
Shang Tsung, I will win the Mortal Kombat tournament and free Earthrealm from your tyranny. Is that so? Then it seems I will need a stronger opponent to defeat the great Kung Lao. Goro, fight! <laughs> Shichinko, you have arrived! Let us begin. You have a long way to go, but every step is a victory. How you maneuver in combat plays as much a part of your strategy as how you punch or kick. Shujinko, the one Master Bo Raicho mentioned. I've seen you around before. You and your friends are always pretending to be famous warriors in that park over there. My name is Apep. Master Bo Raicho asked me to show you the other schools where he teaches martial arts. Follow me. Here it is. This is another of Master Bo Raicho's classrooms. I think he's starting another lesson right now. You should go inside. I will wait for you out here. The next class is beyond this bridge. We need to pay the toll to get across, but I have no money. We must find some other means to pay the guard. You are right. The guard at the bridge must be hungry. Please take this ham to him. Ham. I love ham. Thank you very much. Last stop. The Earthrealm Academy of Martial Arts. Most of us call it fight school. This is where students learn the more advanced techniques. Some of the best warriors in Earthrealm have studied here. I am training in Tai Chi these days but I hope to learn many more fighting skills. Someday, I want to be the greatest warrior in Earthrealm. I will show the real Shang Tsung who is the best and kick him all the way back to Outworld. Anyway, I have to go to class now, but I will see you later. I hope you decide to join our school. Bye. I am sorry, Shujinko, but I cannot let you pass these gates. Why not? The walls of this town are here for a reason. To protect the citizens from foreign dangers. You are too young and inexperienced to venture outside. Return when you can prove to me that you have learned enough and I may let you pass. Yes, Master Boraicho. I will continue my training. Greetings, Shujinko. Who? What are you? Do not be afraid. I am Damashi. I am an emissary of the Elder Gods. The Elder Gods? Yes. They are the powers that made this world possible, as well as many others. I have come to you on their behalf because they need your help. What kind of help do gods need? The Elder Gods are in need of a champion. One who could complete a quest to save the realms. Shujinko. Will you accept this quest to save all that exists? You will be a true hero. What if I refuse? Then I will find another. One of your friends, perhaps. 
The one who pretends to be Shang Tsung. No, not him. I will be your champion. What must I do? You must traverse the realms in search of items of great importance. But Master Bo Raicho will not let me outside the walls of the town. Not to worry, Shijinko. I will bestow upon you a great power. The ability to absorb the fighting skills from any fighter you encounter. This will give you the edge you will need on your quest. Go now. Return to Master Bo Raicho and show him you are an experienced fighter. I will, Damashi. Thank you. I will not let the Elder Gods down. Back so soon? I thought you had returned to the school. I am ready to prove that my combat skills are good enough. Oh, very well, Shujinko. Show me. Fight! impressed, Shujinko. I had no idea you possessed such an aptitude for martial arts. I have no doubt that you will be able to handle yourself in the outside world. Thank you, Master Bo Raicho. You show great potential. I... I would very much like to train you myself. Perhaps I can mold you into the next great defender of Earthrealm. Train me personally? I would be honored. But first, I have tasks to complete outside the gate. Not a problem. I train all my advanced students at my home down the road. Meet me there later, and we will resume your training. I will see you there. Goodbye, Master Bo Raicho. Goodbye, Shujinko. Shujinko, I see you have passed your test. Yes, Damashi. The power you gave me to copy other warriors worked well. I really felt as if I could fight like Master Bo Raicho. He was so impressed that he offered to train me personally. Excellent. There is much you can learn from him. But first, you should begin your quest. You must find six items of great importance. The Kamido. Think of them as tools of the gods. There is an impending doom that threatens the survival of all the realms. With these tools, the Elder Gods will vanquish this menace. Where do I find these? Kami Dogu. They have been scattered throughout reality. Each one lies hidden in a different realm. The Elder Gods are unable to retrieve these items themselves, and therefore must elect a champion born within the realms to collect them. They have constructed portals and the Nexus to aid their champion in his quest. What is the Nexus? Where do I find it? Once you have found the first Kami Dogu, I will show you what to do. Until then, Good luck with your search. Thank you, Damashi. Master Boraicho's house lies to the northeast. I should head in that direction. Greetings, Shujinko. It is good to see you again. As promised, I will now impart to you my most powerful techniques. I am honored, Master Boraicho. I train my most promising students here at my home, away from prying eyes, to assure that my secrets are known only to those I trust. Now, let us begin your training. Congratulations, Shujinko. You have completed your training. It has always amazed me how quickly you learn. You have excelled far beyond my other students these past five years. It is as if you have been granted a gift by the Elder Gods themselves. <laughs> I'm grateful for your kind words, Master. And I am grateful for all that you have taught me. You have learned much as my pupil, but my training can only take you so far. Experience is the ultimate teacher. To further your training, you must venture into the world. Through your journeys in this realm and others, you will attain enlightenment. 
May I suggest, for your first adventure, that you help me find my warrior's medallion. I seem to have lost it. Very well, Master. I will help search for your medallion. May I ask where you saw it last? I seem to recall having it a few nights ago at the docks. Perhaps you can begin your search there. I will stay here and look around the house. Farewell, Shuchinko, and good luck. Farewell, Master Boraicho. This must be the dock that Master Boraicho mentioned. I should ask if anyone here knows what happened to the medallion. Excuse me, but have you seen Master Boraicho's warrior's medallion? He says he last remembers having it somewhere around here. Oh yes! He left it here a few nights ago when we were drinking Outworld wine on the dock. I put it in my water house for safekeeping, but some brigands attacked me and stole the tackle box in which I kept my key. Attacking an unarmed fisherman? What cowards! Indeed! Now I am locked out, and I cannot retrieve the medallion for you. Is there anything I can do to help? If you could get my key back from the brigands, I could get you the medallion. They usually do not stray far from the beach. I will return with your key, fisherman, and these brigands will know the fist of Shujinko. I thank you, young man. Uh, who is Shujinko? I have returned with your key. The brigands will not likely harass you further. Splendid, young man. Come inside and you will find the medallion. Thank you, young man. When you see Bo Raicho, tell him I will drink him under the table when next we meet. <laughs> Shujinko. It has been five years since you began your quest for the Kami Dome. Have you made any progress? I am afraid not, Damashi. But I have learned Master Boraicho's fighting styles, and I have recovered his lost warrior's medallion. I was on my way to return it to him. I see. That is quite an impressive artifact. I suggest you keep the medallion for yourself. Do not return it to Boraicho just yet. Such an item will give you credibility among master warriors. I will do as you ask. Good, very good. I must leave you now, but you will see me again. Good luck on your journey. Stop, infidel! Only great warriors are allowed to enter the Ling Kuei Temple. I am a great warrior. I have been personally trained by Master Boraicho, and have been awarded the Warrior's Medallion to prove it. Warrior's Medallion? You are truly worthy of the Ling Kuei. We could use a warrior with your ability. Step inside and you will be trained to fight as a Ling Kuei. Your teacher will be none other than Sub-Zero himself. Sub-Zero. <laughs> Finished your training. You are now a Lin Kuei warrior. For your first assignment, the Grand Master has commanded that you join our forces to the West. They have reported finding an unknown artifact that may greatly benefit our clan. We must secure it before our rivals do. Your password is Ice Dragon. Go now. Do not return until you have succeeded in securing the artifact. As you command.
I wonder where I am supposed to meet these Lin Kuei. It must be somewhere right around here. Halt! What is the password? Ice Dragon. Excellent. You must be the courier we had sent for. And a new recruit, if I am not mistaken. You are just in time. There are Red Dragon not far from here, and they know we have this item. Take it to the Lin Kuei Temple. We will distract the Red Dragon to aid your departure. I will leave at once. Damashi, I have joined the Lin Kuei. I have learned Sub-Zero's fu- That object you carry. Yes, it is as I suspected. Through the ignorance of the Lin Kuei, you have acquired the Earthrealm Kamidoru. I have? You must find the portal to the Nexus. When it opens, walk through to continue your quest. But the Lin Kuei- Must I remind you that your loyalties are to the Elder Gods, not to the Lin Kuei. Continue with your appointed quest. Yes, Damashi. I understand. Shujiko, raise high the Kamidogu. Enter the portal. First, place the earth round Kamidogu on the altar and you will know. It would seem that the Elder Gods wish for their champion to search the nether realm next. I must warn you, it is a dark and evil place. I will be on my guard. Is this not what you expected? This place, it feels dark. As dark as every heart that it has. Normally, your presence here would not be possible. Only evil resides in the Nether. So how is it that I am here? Perhaps your time with the Vim Kuei has left a small stain of corruption on your soul. Corruption? But you must not dwell on that. What is important is your quest. Most likely, the Nether Realm Kamidoro will not be found within the walls of this city. You must venture deep into these wretched plains of hell if you are to recover it. This is not going to be pleasant, but I will complete my task. I am Shujinko. Pardon my intrusion, but you do not look like a demon of the Nether Realm. I am Ashra. I was once like the others before I found the means to purge myself of the evil taint that permeates all who reside here. By slaying demons with an enchanted sword, I will gradually transform into a being whom this realm cannot contain. Eventually, I will be free. And how is it you exist in this place? You do not seem to belong here yourself. I am from Earthrealm. I see. Be warned, Shujinko. The Netherrealm is quite hostile to outsiders. If you are to survive against its denizens, you will need special skills. I offer to train you in the art of combat that will be most effective here. I accept your I most gracious offer, I have now shown you the techniques Ashra. for fighting let the your demons training of this begin. place, Shujinko. May this knowledge serve you well. Thank you, Ashra. I believe I am ready to brave the depths of the Netherrealm. Perhaps a test is in order. Meet me at the temple outside of town. I will find you a suitable opponent. We will see if you have indeed learned all I have taught you. 
I look forward to this chance to test myself. So this is the demon known as Ashra. Your notoriety extends as far as our world. Many of Shao Kahn's Netherrealm allies have fallen to your blade. Thus, he has hinted his assassin to deal with you. Yes, I am aware of the demon known as Ermac. I welcome his arrival. Until then, you will serve as combat practice. Round one. Fight! <laughs> That Tarkatan was not a pure demon, but a mutated hybrid of demon and mortal races. There was not much to gain from his death. Were I to defeat the powerful demon Ermac, however, I would surely ascend from this place much sooner. If while on your quest you should encounter him, lead him to me. It is here that I am most powerful. If I see him, I will do as you ask. What manner of beast are you? I am no beast. I am Shujinko from Earthrealm, and I am in search of a powerful demon. I have an acquaintance who wants to deal with him. As commanded by the Emperor Shao Kahn, we search for a powerful demon as well. But we are bound together by sorcery, and the lower planes of this realm drain magical power. Our bond, our strength, is fading. We fear that we will not have the strength to destroy our enemy. Why do you say we and our? We will explain later if you help us. There is not much time. I will most certainly help you. What must I do? Help us find a soul stone. A large red monolith covered with ancient runes. We can replenish the magic power that binds our souls together and continue our trek. Do this for us, and we will reveal to you our knowledge of combat as payment. I will search for the soul stone. This appears to be the soul stone that warrior mentioned. I must inform him of its location. Greetings. I have found the soul stone. It is to the east, not far from here. We must go there immediately. Come, we will reward you once we have regained our strength. Yes, this is it. A soul stone. We can feel our strength returning. What exactly is a soul stone? Many ages ago, the first sorcerers toiled for the Elder Gods, linking the realms with portals. The lower planes of the Nether Realm are quite hazardous to beings of magic. Beneath inhospitable places, they erected soul stones, which restored their energies as they worked. Why did the sorcerers build the portals for the Elder Gods? They were built as a defense from some unforeseen cataclysm. We do not concern ourselves with such myths, however. Now we will honor our promise and impart to you our combat knowledge. Prepare yourself, as the power of Ermac is revealed. Ermac. The demon you seek, does it have a name? Her name is Ashra. She has slain many of Shao Kahn's Netherrealm allies. For this, he has commanded us to destroy her. Interesting. She is looking for you as well. She believes you are a demon and will combat you to purify her soul. Her misconceptions are of no importance. You must reveal to us her location. She is near a temple to the northwest. She is waiting for you. Then we must leave at once. At last. 
last, I will defeat the demon Ermac. Your death will bring me closer to purification and ultimately my release from this realm. We are no demon. Surely you can sense that we are not of your kind. Nonetheless, there must be some evil residing within you, or you could not have entered the Nether Realm. Enough. You have killed many of Shao Kahn's allies in your quest to purify your soul. You will pay for your insolence. Is this the sum of your might, Ashra? It will take much more to defeat us. And more you shall receive! Damashi! Damashi, where are you? Who dare summon me to this... Oh, Sh Shujiko. It has been many years since last we met. Why have I not seen you in so long a time? I take precautions to avoid this place. It drains me. If my avatar were to stay here for too long, or descend too far into the lower plains, I could be trapped here forever. Your avatar? I do not understand. I am without a physical body and am only able to appear to you by extending my spirit into the realms. It is my hope that I will one day return to the physical world. Until then, I must guide you as a simple apparition. And how goes your search? I have found the Nether Realm Kamidogu. So it seems. Well done, Shujiko. Return to the Nexus and place the Kamidogu on the altar. Mistaken. I am the Elder God's champion. Stand down. You leave me no choice. Prepare to be destroyed. Yes, Damashi. I am unharmed. Who was that warrior in the Nexus? I am not entirely sure. I could sense that he was quite powerful, but I did not recognize him. He referred to himself as the Elder God's chosen warrior. Does he think he is their champion? If he thinks this, that he is mistaken. As I have said before, you are their champion. You must continue your search in this realm, the realm of chaos. Chaos? The nature of this realm is one of a constant turmoil. The beings here oppose order and structure. Chaos is their religion. Be wary, stranger. 
A wraith from the Netherrealm has seized the cemetery in the name of the Brotherhood of Shadow. Such an act is a violation of the Way of Chaos. May I challenge the Infiltrator? I have been endowed with powers from the Elder Gods themselves. I may be able to drive him off for you. I admire your fighting spirit. You are most welcome to confront him. Are you the Netherrealm Wraith who haunts this holy site? Another fool has come to challenge me. So be it. As I told the others, I have taken this patch of dead terrain for the Brotherhood of Shadow. We shall see, Spawn of Hell. Round one, fight! <laughs> Two choices, stranger. State your intentions, or hear the shattering of your spine. I wander in search of holy relics, madman. Do not block my path. Ah, a wanderer, eh? I am Havoc, a cleric of chaos. I would never think of confining a spirit such as yours. Thank you, Havoc. I am Shujinko. I am a newcomer to the realm of chaos. There are many newcomers as of late. Satan guards men, for instance. They seek to restrict the flow of our water, something we hold as sacred. Water was not meant to be controlled. Its shapeless, fluidic nature is a blessing. I make you an offer, Shujinko. Take these four Chaos Pendants. Defeat each of the four Satan invaders and place a pendant around their necks. The pendants will shatter the bondage of order and reveal to them the perfection of chaos. Only then will they cease the enslavement of our water. Do this for me, and I will teach you the ways of chaos as well. Who are these Satan guardsmen? They are soldiers of an oppressive realm that have come to impose their order. They seek to control and alter our water supply for their own ends. Their presence here is offensive. I will do as you request. Only if it suits you at the time. I would not have it any other way. May chaos break the rules that bind my friend. You do not appear to be a Sadan. Did Havoc send you? Yes. He has asked that I defeat these intruders and place these pendants around their necks. I have been trying to sabotage this facility. But thus far, the invaders have foiled my plans. If you could reduce their numbers, I would have an easier time crippling their pumps. I will try. Where are they now? There is an invader in each of the four corners of the facility. I will meet you here when I am finished dealing with them. These premises are off limits. Round one, fight! Done it! You have converted the Satan Guardsmen to the ways of chaos! Havoc will be most pleased. He waits for you in the town to the south. Oh.
You have converted the Satan Guardsmen to the ways of chaos. They shut down their facilities and came here for guidance. I propose to them a mission in their home of Satan, the realm of order. They have already embarked on the quest. I thank you for your assistance. You said you would show me the way of chaos if I were to free their minds. As if I would honor a deal? You should know better than to bind a man of chaos to his word. I will free myself of this oppression. Fight. Well done. Well done? You tried to kill me. Nonsense. How could I teach you the way of chaos if there was an agreement, a structure to the lesson? Oh, I think I understand. I was learning from the unpredictable nature of experience, not from a structured tutorial. I did not realize you had no intentions of harming me when you attacked, and therefore I learned to adapt to what I perceived to be a real threat. You are correct, except I would have killed you if you had given me the chance. I was quite serious. Because you have survived my assault, however, I give you this key to an ancient labyrinth. May it unleash chaos upon your journey. Yes, I found it in a labyrinth not far from here, but I feel strange. I feel like I have changed. Indeed, you have. Many years have passed since you first entered this realm. I suspect the labyrinth you encountered contains some time-altering agent. Time has passed, but you have not perceived it. Many years? By the gods. I do feel older. It must have been that strange liquid I stepped through. That is a distinct possibility. It matters not. You should return to the Nexus and place it on the altar. You have done well, Shujiko. The Elder Gods will be pleased. this realm. This is the domain of the Emperor Shao Kahn. Emperor indeed. He is a thief, a deceiver. He is not the rightful lord of this realm. There was a time when he was much like Raiden is to your earth realm, an advisor, but he abandoned his position and stole Outworld for himself. Who ruled Outworld before Shao Kahn? A powerful military commander, Onaga, the Dragon King. In that age, Outworld was unified. Under Shao Kahn's rule, however, Outworld has become a dangerous and chaotic place. Be wary as you continue with your quest. I will keep my eyes open, Damashi. Look at what we have here! Another straggler for Melina to sink her teeth into! 
I do not wish for trouble, but I will defend myself if necessary. I must warn you that I am quite skilled in the art of combat. Is that so? We will see how long you can endure my attacks. I will sharpen my teeth with your bones! Impressive! You survived my assault! You are a great warrior. There is much we can gain from one as skilled as you. I thank you for your kind words, Melina. Perhaps you would be interested in assisting our cause. Recently, the walled city of Lei Chen has defied the rule of the Emperor Shao Kahn. He has sent us, his Tarkatan forces, to take the head of the Overlord there. We would like to complete our objective without incident, but we will use force if necessary. Would you act as our voice and convince this fool of an Overlord to surrender his life to Shao Kahn, so that his subjects will be spared? What if the Overlord refuses to surrender? Everyone in the city will be slain. The city walls are strong, but they will not hinder our assault for long. This is a most uncomfortable position for me. But if it means the citizens will be spared, I will see what I can do. You have our word. Bring us the head of the Overlord and we will spare them all. Are you the ruler of this city? Yes, I am Overlord Zephyro. State your business. Shao Kahn has sent his Tarkatan horde to attack my city. That is precisely why I am here. I have come to you with a message from the Tarkatan forces outside your walls. You have my attention. Go on. Shao Kahn has offered your people amnesty. Under one condition. You must surrender your head. My head? Unacceptable. I will never surrender myself to Shao Kahn. Not even to save my people. The Tarkata grow in number outside the walls of your city. It is only a matter of time before they overwhelm your military and destroy you all. For the sake of your people, I strongly... There may be another solution. If word of our struggle were to reach Sado, the realm of order, their elite guardsmen may give us aid. If I can find that realm, I will tell them of your plight. Excellent. You will need something of value to offer as payment. My city has been overtaxed by Shao Kahn, and therefore I have nothing suitable here. But there are rumors of a priceless object hidden somewhere in the living forest. If you can locate it, give it as payment to the Saden for their assistance. Please do not delay. Not to fear. I will bring help. you what are you doing in the living forest I have been sent here to search for a valuable item said to be hidden in this area you are too late I have already found it my queen sent me to secure it from the tyrant Shao Kahn it seems I have located it just in time die outworld mutant round one fight <laughs> I did not realize it was the Kamidogu. The overlord of Lei Chen had asked me to offer it to the Seiden guardsmen as payment for their assistance in defending against the Tarkatan hordes. It belongs to the Elder Gods and must be returned to them. You will place it on the altar with the others. But I have given my word that I would bring back help from the Realm of Order. How will I broker a deal with them if I cannot offer the Kamidogu? The point is moot. You cannot enter the realm of order without placing this Kamidogu on the altar. If indeed you wish to aid the Overlord, I suggest you offer the command of his city to the Sage Militia. Their principal philosophy is one of order and control. They will have little interest in defending a city unless they occupy it. 
Furthermore, they will not resist the chance to thwart Shao Kahn. But the Overlord did not give me the authority to... What he wants is of no concern to us. The Kamidoru is not his to use as a bargaining chip. We're over a deal with the Satan if you feel so compelled, but do not lose sight of your primary objective. Return the outworld Kamidoru to its rightful place in the Nexus, and continue with your quest. I will do as you ask, Damashi. to abide by their laws if I do not know them. This civilization has been built upon the concept of structure and organization. Deviation from this ideal is not tolerant. I cannot stress enough that you must avoid any entanglements in their legal system. I believe the likelihood of that happening is small, but I will heed your warning, Damashi. Please excuse my interruption, but I am Shujinko, champion of the Elder Gods. I bring a message from the King of Lei Chen requesting the aid of your guardsmen in Outworld. I am quite busy, champion. Get to your point. Lei Chen is under siege and in need of reinforcements to help defend it. Overlord Zephyro has offered to give control of his city to your realm if your guardsmen come to Outworld and defeat Shao Kahn's invading horde. Shao Kahn? Long have we battled against his minions. It would benefit all the realms to further suppress his advance. I am Commander Hotaru. I would pledge my aid to the Outworld City, but I still have work to do here. Help me end this riot by defeating the leader of the Resistance, and I will defend this Overlord. I would think a champion of the gods could end this uprising with ease. I will assist you however I can. Excellent. We will first need to train you to be a Satan Guardsman, for you may not partake in an assault unless you are a deputized member of the Guard. That is our law. Then let us begin my training. Follow me. Congratulations. You are now an honorary member of the Satan Guardsmen. Go now and defeat the leader of the Resistance. His name is Darius. When you have completed this task, meet me here. As you command. Are you the warrior known as Darius? And what if I am? If you are the leader of the Resistance, I have been ordered to defeat you in combat and bring this riot under control. You have found your man. I am Darius. I look forward to resisting the rest. Round one. Fight! Ah! Oh, yeah! have defeated Darius, Commander Hotaru. Well done. It seems the rioters have been demoralized. Your service is no longer required. As promised, I will now depart for the city of Lei Chen in Outworld. Thank you, Hotaru. I will meet you there. Chujinko, 
You have returned. It is good to see you again, Hotaru. It seems the city is no longer under siege. I drove off the invaders. They will most likely regroup and resume their assault, but I will stay to protect the city as long as is needed. I have taken control of this city in the name of order, as we agreed. However, King Zephyro seemed not to recall that arrangement. Men often do not recall the details of bargains they make out of desperation. It makes no difference. The agreement is binding. As punishment for his forgetfulness, I have stripped him of his position. I now rule this town in the name of Sado. Uh, congratulations, Hotaru. Now, if you will excuse me, I must see to its governing if I am to keep this town under control. Come with us, human. Do not resist. You are outnumbered. This is the Overlord's emissary, the one who brought the Satan warrior Hotaru to defend the walled city of Lei Chen. I have lost many Tarkatan warriors to your treachery, human. You were to convince the Overlord to surrender, not bring him reinforcements. He would not surrender. I did not wish to see his people suffer for his decision. Whatever quarrel you may have had with Overlord Zephyro, you had no right to punish them as well. Shao Kahn's order is all the right I need. Overlord Zafiro defied him. When Shao Kahn discovers that our assault has failed, our punishment will be severe. I should allow my horde to rip you to pieces. Yes, allow your soldiers to do what you are too frightened to do yourself. What? I am Baraka, leader of the Takata. I fear no one, least of all a human. Then face me in combat. If you are so sure of your strength, kill me yourself. But if I emerge victorious, you must complete one task for me. <laughs> Agreed. My warriors will enjoy eating your flesh when I am done with you. Enough. I have shown you enough of my combat skills. I must keep some techniques to myself. I thank you for what you have shown me. I will command my troops to allow you safe passage from our encampment. Go back to your portal and never return to this realm. Yes, I will leave this realm at once. There is nothing more that I need here. Shujiko, I bring the tidings. What do you mean, Damashi? You have sacrificed much in your service to the Elder Gods these long years. Therefore, they are granting you that which you have desired since your childhood. A chance to compete in the Mortal Kombat tournament in Earthrealm and defeat the sorcerer Shang Tsung. I do not know what to say. How did they know of my dreams of defeating Shang Tsung? Long ago, I watched you from afar as you played with your childhood friends. It was quite clear that you worshipped the warrior Kun Lao. But unlike your hero, you will be more than a match for Shang Tsung. You have absorbed the fighting styles of many great warriors. Now is your chance to fulfill your dream. Thank you, Damashi. I will return to Earthrealm at once. Please excuse my curiosity, but why do you cover your eyes? Are you blind? Yes, due to the treachery of the sorcerer Shang Tsung. You have met Shang Tsung? He preyed upon my desire to prove my superiority in combat. He promised to show me the location of a powerful sword that would complement my skills. The sword was entombed among the souls of my warrior ancestors. Shang Tsung consumed their souls to increase his power. The experience left me blinded. Is the sword from your tail the one you now carry? Yes. The sword guides me. Over the years, it has shown me the way to use my other senses in combat. Most impressive. You are truly a warrior of distinction. Now I have but one goal, to slay the sorcerer who blinded me. Doing so will free the consumed souls of my ancestors. If you provide me with his location, I will teach you to fight without your eyes. I am to enter his Mortal Kombat tournament. When I find him, I will return to you with any information I uncover. My search for Shang Tsung will continue here in the north. I suggest you look in the southwest. This is sacred ground, stranger. 
I am Night Wolf. I must ask you to leave this place before your evil taint defiles the sanctity of these grounds. I do not understand. I am Shujinko. I assure you that I mean no disrespect to your people. I sense corruption in your soul, Shujinko. A spiritual contamination that I have never before perceived. I feel no touch of evil, but my travels have taken me to many worlds. Perhaps it is a result of my journeys in the Nether Realm. It is possible. If you will allow me, I may be able to purge this contagion from your being, although it will take many years to accomplish. Many years? It will delay my quest, but I suppose I should take advantage of your offer. accomplished much since beginning your spiritual cleansing, Shujenko. Though the taint of evil continues its hold on you, my training has given you the ability to control it. I am grateful for what you have done for me, Nightwolf. I wish you luck on your journeys. You are always welcome in the lands of my... Greetings, stranger. I search for experienced fighters to take part in a competition. Do you know of any? I am quite adept at many fighting styles. Who are you? What is this contest you speak of? I am Shang Tsung. My Mortal Kombat tournament will begin soon on my island fortress. Only the best will be allowed to enter. Shang Tsung? Long have I heard tales of your foul deeds. I am Shu Jinko. Since I was a boy, I have dreamed of winning the Mortal Kombat tournament and ridding Earthrealm of your tyranny. Is that so? Then it seems I will have to test the great Shu Jinko. You are most welcome to compete, but only if you can prove that you are worthy of such an honor. Fight! Most impressive, Shu Jinko. You are indeed worthy to compete in the Mortal Kombat tournament. I will enjoy consuming your soul when you lose. I do not think so. It has been my greatest desire to win Earthrealm's freedom from you and your master, Shao Kahn. Of course, I am not the only one who seeks your defeat. I request that an acquaintance of mine be allowed to compete as well. He too longs to challenge you. <laughs> Would this acquaintance of yours be the blind swordsman Kenshi? He has been searching for me for quite some time, has he not? You know? There is little in this realm that escapes my attention, though I must admit I was surprised to learn that he had survived our previous encounter. Return to him and inform him that he is welcome to face me on my island in the Lost Sea. The tournament is fast approaching, however. He must hurry if he wishes to fulfill his quest for revenge. Shujenko, it has been many years since last we met. Although I have sensed Shang Tsung's presence on many occasions, I have not been able to locate him. I have found him, Kenshi. He has invited us both to his island to face him in mortal combat. He has been watching you. He knew that you were searching for him. I had suspected as much. This explains why I have never been able to find him. He was always one step ahead of me. I thank you for bringing me this news. I will now teach you to do battle without the use of your eyes. Now that I have fulfilled my promise, I must leave for Shang Tsung's island. I only hope he has not been defeated before I arrive. Indeed, you have a long-standing vendetta with Shang Tsung. But I have dreamed of entering the Mortal Kombat tournament since I was young. You will have to wait your turn, my friend. If he is still alive when I am finished with him, you may take your revenge. We will see, Shujinko. I will meet you on the island. Shujiko, I return to you because I sense that some change has taken place. You are different in some way. I have undergone a spiritual cleansing. The warrior Nightwolf had detected an evil stain upon my soul. He was unable to remove it completely but he has given me the ability to suppress it. This is an unfortunate turn of events. Unfortunate? An evil stain has been cleansed from my soul. My sense of awareness is as heightened as it was when Master Boraicho trained me. 
the taint you refer to allows you to enter realms otherwise inaccessible to other beings. You will need to regain it in order to continue your quest. I suggest that you return to the Nether. It will restore the impurities needed to enter the more accursed realms. Once your quest is finished, you are free to plant your spirit once more. I cannot believe that you would ask such a thing of me. Surely the contamination I am already forced to carry is enough to access... Do not question my order, Shujiko. I never promised your quest would be pleasant. You must fulfill your obligation to the Elder Gods. Return to the Netherrealm. Have you forgotten the Mortal Kombat tournament? I was on my way to Shang Tsung's island to compete. I understand your disappointment, but your dream of defeating Shang Tsung will have to wait. For now, you must fulfill your destiny. I... I will do as you ask. Be gone. This portal is not for use by mortals. Who are you? I am the Thunder God, Raiden. This ancient portal has been activated. I must secure it to prevent intrusion from other realms. Lord Raiden, I am Shujinko. I am the champion of the Elder Gods. It was I who opened the portal. Champion, you say? I think not. A champion of the Elder Gods would possess the might of ten warriors and could fight with his eyes closed. It is highly unlikely that you possess such abilities. Round one. Fight! <laughs> seem to possess much strength and skill, Shujinko. Forgive me for doubting you, but if the Elder Gods have indeed unleashed their champion, they must be concerned that the end of the realms is near. Your presence might be connected with the Mortal Kombat tournament here in Earthrealm. Have you come to aid us? I did come to fight for Earthrealm in the tournament, but I have recently been ordered to the Netherrealm. I am sure the Elder Gods have their reasons for redirecting you at so crucial a time. It may be that the Shaolin have already chosen their representative. In any event, I will keep a close watch over the tournament's proceedings. Shang Tsung is a treacherous sorcerer. If he wins this time, Earthrealm will belong to Shao Kahn. If you need my aid when I am finished with my task in the Netherrealm, search for me. I will gladly assist you. Thank you, Shujinko. Good luck. Unless you have knowledge of the sorcerer Quan Chi's whereabouts, do not waste my time, stranger. I have no knowledge of this Quan Chi, but I may be able to help you find him. I am Shu Jinko. I have explored this realm before and have become quite familiar with it. I have returned to the Nether Realm once again to absorb its impurities. I will likely be wandering these wastes for some time to come. If I discover this Quan Chi, I will relay to you what information I can. For a price. It would seem that you have already regained some of the Netherrealm's dark taint. What price do you ask? You are obviously quite powerful in this realm. If I were to learn your combat skills, perhaps I would absorb enough negative energy to lessen my time here. Teaching you the dark rage that has consumed me since my death will only serve to delay my vengeance upon Quan Chi. I refuse your offer. Delay you at will. But you will also gain an ally to aid your search. You will likely find Quan Chi sooner if I search with you. I did not realize that such all-consuming hatred was possible. Quan Chi killed my family and clan, and then deceived me into believing Sub-Zero was their murderer. 
I have been corrupted by Quan Chi's wickedness. Now it is his turn to suffer. It is a heavy burden you carry. And one that will be lifted once I have destroyed the evil sorcerer. Go now and search for Quan Chi. I will remain in the Nether Realm until he is found, Scorpion. Who are you? What do you want? I am Shu Jinko. I am searching for the sorcerer Quan Chi. You have found him. I do not recognize you as a brother of Shadow. Who has sent you? I sent him. Scorpion! You thought you could elude me here? In the lower reaches of the Nether Realm, my strength increases while yours fades. I will make you suffer for killing my family and clan. There is nowhere you can run, sorcerer! I will have my revenge! I will torment you forever, sorcerer! Back! Stay back! I command you! Come here! Did you hear that? It sounds like battle! Come, we will feast upon the loser! Shujiko, I sense you have regained enough of the essence of this realm to continue your quest. I encountered a ninja specter named Scorpion from whom I absorbed much rage. Well done. You may leave the Nether Realm. Thank you, Damashi. I do not wish to remain another moment longer. Greetings, champion. I have need of your assistance. Raiden, whatever I can do to help you, do not hesitate to ask. My time in the Nether Realm is concluded. Shang Tsung has allied with another sorcerer, Quan Chi, who has escaped from the Nether Realm. Escaped? I had just seen him there. Quan Chi possesses an item created by the Elder Gods, an amulet that acts like a key. He understands only a fraction of its potential, but enough to use it to escape from hell. Is it a Kamidogu? It is not a Kamidogu, but it is connected to them by its function. I am surprised that you would not know of it. Nevertheless, I am preparing an assault on the two sorcerers in Outworld. Though they have already killed Earthrealm's greatest hero, Liu Kang, I am gathering together the few warriors I feel I can trust to attack this deadly alliance at their stronghold. Can I count on you to help? I will go to Outworld to assist you any way I can. Excellent. It will be good to have a champion of the Elder Gods on our side. That's far enough. Stop where you are. Is there a problem, sir? Name's Kano. By order of the sorcerers Quan Chi and Shang Tsung, all denizens of Outwear will submit to the rule of the Deadly Alliance. I am not a denizen of Outworld. I have traveled here from Earthrealm. Makes no difference. My men will take you to the town of Sundo. Quan Chi and Shang Tsung have a job for you, mate. And if I refuse? Do you really think you can combat us all? No, I suppose not. 
Then shut up and follow me. What's your name, anyway? I am called Shujinko. Well, Shujinko, welcome to hell. Along with all the other peons of this town, you'll be constructing a palace for Shang Tsung. One that is large enough to house his army. Don't even think about trying to escape. I would hate to have to kill a villager because of your defiance. Do you get me? I... I understand. Good. Now make yourself useful. Get to work. You are not from this town. Who are you? Why have you been enslaved here? I am Shujinko. I am from Earthrealm, on a quest for the Elder Gods. I have been instructed to return to Outworld to confront a growing threat here. I seem to have found it. I am Li Mei. My village was the first conquest of the Deadly Alliance. They have enslaved my people. For this, I will kill them in due time. What is your plan of attack? The Deadly Alliance have offered to free my village if I win their combat tournament. I have accepted their challenge, but I intend to use the tournament as a way to get closer to them. I will attack when they least expect it. Bold words, young one, but perhaps a bit foolish. What makes you think you can defeat them both? I will concede that I am not ready to confront them yet, for I desperately need additional training. Perhaps I may be of some help. Over the years, I have absorbed much combat skill. Then you must teach me, Shujinko. Help me to save my people from oppression. I will teach you what I can, Li Mei. But I do not approve of your intention to combat the two sorcerers alone. I believe that course of action will end in misfortune. Thank you for your training, Master Shujinko. Please accept this token of my appreciation. I thank you for the gift, Li Mei. Perhaps your confrontation with the sorcerers is not necessary. I know of someone who might help to free your village. His name is Hotaru. He once saved the walled city of Lei Chen from the Tarkatan hordes. I will journey there and ask for his assistance. If you think he can drive out the Deadly Alliance, then by all means, find this Hotaru and tell him of our plight. I will do my best to convince him to help. The guards are watching. I must not draw their attention if I am to escape your village. Goodbye, Li Mei. Hotaru, it is good to see. You have violated my ordinance. You were to go indoors when the toll sounded. Ordinance? I just recently arrived. I had no knowledge of any ordinance. Ignorance is not an excuse. I am placing you under arrest for disregarding the laws of this city. Your trial will take place in the realm of order. What is this place? Why have I been taken from my cell? You are about to enter the judicial court of the realm of order. You have been brought here to defend yourself against the charges brought against you by Commander Hotaru. After all these long years, justice will at last prevail. Surely I will not remain imprisoned for a law as frivolous as a curfew. I would not be as confident if I were you. These were the guards I was sent to dispose of? Fah! Surely you could have slain them yourself. Why have you killed them? Who are you? I am Dairu. An associate of yours was concerned that certain obligations you have to him are not being met. I was contracted to remove any obstacles you might be facing. Tomashi, I cannot believe that he would instruct you to kill these men in order to free me. Not instructed, paid. Mercenaries do not work for free. This Tamashi offered me generous compensation to free you. Do not be so sure of your chances with the judge. I was once a soldier among their ranks until I was unjustly imprisoned. You would have been incarcerated for decades for this seemingly minor charge, I assure you. I cannot say that I approve of your actions, but I suppose a certain amount of gratitude is in order, Dairu. There is one other matter. I am to give you this key to the courtroom door. I took it from one of the guards. 
I will leave you now, but if you ever have need of my services, search for me in the realm of order. Just remember to bring plenty of coins. Shujinko, I am disappointed with you. Hotaru! I thought I had trained you to appreciate order, to obey the law. Now I find that you have killed two officers and have broken into a courtroom. I did not kill those men. An assassin named Dairu. Now you are consorting with known felons to free yourself. Had you simply waited for your trial, you would have no doubt been found innocent. In fact, I had come here to testify in your defense. Now it seems that you will be facing a sentence of death. If it has come to that, I have no other choice but to resist arrest. Round one. Fight! Assassin, yes. I do not understand how you could condone such an action. Are these the methods of the Elder Gods? I am not an Elder God. I am merely your guide. In any event, do not presume to judge my methods. You yourself have done many dishonorable things during your lifelong journey. To answer your question, however, the Elder Gods would not have objected to the methods applied. I may have done questionable things during my service to the Elder Gods, but I have also grown much since my quest began. I cannot believe the Elder Gods would not take exception to such brutal tactics. The Elder Gods do not directly interfere with the realms, nor do they judge the events that occur therein. Their duty is merely to assure that the realms exist. And my quest plays some part in their duty? I will not explain further. All will be revealed in time. Take the Kamidobu to the Nexus and continue your search. Yes, Dimashi. I will do as you ask. But I cannot help but feel disenchanted with the quest. Shujinko, you have but one Kamidobu left to find before your task is complete. It lies hidden in this realm. The realm of Edenia. But beware, I sense there is another force at work. Someone else may be after the Kamidobu. Someone else? For what purpose? You have never fully revealed to me the true significance of the Kamidobu. After all these years of searching, I feel I am owed an explanation. <sighs> if it will serve to emphasize the importance of your quest, I will tell you what I can. The Kamidobu made possible the creation of reality. The Elder Gods used them to split the consciousness of the One Being into what we know as the Realms. I do not understand. What is this One Being? Before the creation of the Realms, there were only the Elder Gods and the One Being. The One Being fed off the Elder Gods. It consumed them. A war raged in the timeless void until six Elder Gods forged the Kamidobu and used them to splinter the One Being into the many realms. I am humbled by the scope of what you have revealed to me. Still, I am left to wonder why the Elder Gods have needed my assistance. As you know, you were called by the Elder Gods to retrieve the Kamidobu and deliver them into safekeeping. What you do not know is that the Elder Gods have detected a plot whereby an individual sought to exploit the Kamido and merged all the realms in an attempt to gain ultimate power. That individual may be here in Edenia. He must not be allowed to find the Kamidobu. It would seem that the Kamidogu are quite powerful. 
dangerous weapons in the wrong hands. I thank you for being forthright with me, Damashi. I have no doubt that you will succeed, Shichinko. You have served the other gods well. You... you emerged from the portal to the gods. How can this be? I am Shujinko, champion of the Elder Gods. I am searching the realms for artifacts that will aid in the fight against evil. My quest has led me here. I am Princess Kitana. If you are the champion of the Elder Gods, perhaps you can aid us in our struggle. There was a time long ago when the Emperor Shao Kahn merged Edenia with Outworld. For millennia, he ruled the combined realms until my Earthrealm allies and I won Adenia's independence. Now Shao Kahn has again invaded this realm. He has learned that a powerful device lies hidden somewhere within our borders and may have sent his forces here to find it. Shao Kahn? He must be after the Edenian Kamidogu. This situation is worse than I had suspected. How may I be of help, Princess Katana? My mother, Queen Sindel, has been taken captive. I cannot free her myself, because I must return to Outworld to lead our forces there in a direct assault against the Emperor. Free the Queen, so that she may lead the resistance here in Edenia. Where is the Queen being held? She is imprisoned somewhere near the palace, guarded by the traitor, Tanya. You must defeat Tanya in order to release her. I will win the freedom of your Queen. Of this you can be sure. Thank you, Shujinko, and good luck. Excuse me, but I am looking for the one known as Tanya. Would you happen to know her whereabouts? I am Tanya. Do you have business with the Emperor Shao Kahn? Not exactly. I come to ask that you release Queen Sindel. She has been unjustly held captive by Shao Kahn's forces. <laughs> you are a fool, old man. I have been instructed by Shao Kahn himself to guard her with my life. You will have to get past me if you wish to free her. So be it. Round one. Fight! You are a bit old to be in Shao Kahn's military, are you not? I am Shu Jinko, champion of the Elder Gods. I have come to release you at the request of your daughter, Kitana. She is currently in Outworld, confronting Shao Kahn's army. Kitana lives? You are truly the bearer of good tidings, Shu Jinko. Come, we must leave here now before anyone realizes that I have escaped. Follow me, and I will reward you for your efforts. You are now a fully knighted Adinian soldier, Shujinko. And as such, I have a task for you. What task would that be, your highness? Shao Kahn seeks a powerful item, one that has been kept hidden in Adinia since before our recorded history. It must never fall into the hands of the Emperor of Outworld. Take this Kami Dogu and return it to the Elder Gods. They will know what to do with it. I will take it to them immediately. What will you do now, your highness? Kitana and I will continue the fight to free Adinia from the tyranny of Shao Kahn. His men will be searching for me here, but he has no knowledge of you. You have a chance to escape if you leave now. Yes, your highness. Good luck to you. Shujiko, I see you have found the last of the Kamidoru. Yes, Damashi. I was on my way to the Nexus to place it upon the altar. Because you have recovered all the Kamidoru, 
I will receive a physical body and will be free to dwell in the physical world. My rebirth is to take place soon in our world. That is wonderful news. Congratulations, Damashi. Hurry, take the Adinian Kamidolo to the Nexus. I will meet you there. It will be good to finally bring this quest to an end. After all these long years, I have finally found the last of the Kamidogo. My quest is almost at an end. What is ending is your meddling in the affairs of the Elder Gods, mortal. Scorpion! Yes, and I remember you as well. We met in the Nether Realm. I taught you my fighting skills. Now I will give you your final lesson. Fight! Round one. Fight! <laughs> transported to the Elder Gods. Why is it not happening? <laughs> because you have not completely finished the quest. Who... What are you? Ah, yes. Familiar words. Perhaps this will help you to understand. Damashi! What has he done to you? Let him go! Shujinko! Please save me! <laughs> oh, you fool! Damashi does not exist. The avatar you see before you is merely a projection of my consciousness. I manipulated this astral puppet from beyond the boundaries of death, and in turn, manipulated you. I deceived you into bringing me the means of attaining ultimate mastery over reality. So it seems that I have indeed known you all these years. Then by what name shall I call you now? Tell me who you really are, demon. I am Onaga, the Dragon King of Outworld and soon to be ruler of all that exists. I must thank you for bringing me so much power. The Kanidogu are mine. <laughs> you may have them. They do nothing. You have wasted your time. Nothing happened when I placed them all on the altar. Not all. If you had found the last piece, the altar would have transported them to the Elder Gods. But the last piece is currently in Outworld in the possession of a fool sorcerer. I will deal with him later. For now, I will take these artifacts you have so dutifully collected for me. I am afraid they will not make it into the hands of the Elder Gods after all. And so, Shuchenko, your quest is done. Prepare for death. The Dragon King has not emerged from the portal. Perhaps he has lost interest in pursuing me. More likely, he has gone to Outworld and will confront the sorcerer who possesses the last remaining object. I have been a fool. Blinded by the lure of adventure, I have endangered the realms and betrayed the Elder Gods. The blame is mine alone. What have I done? The Dragon King now possesses the Six Kamidogu and has taken the ancient amulet from Quan Chi and Outworld. Although each item is powerful beyond mortal comprehension, Individually, they contain only a fraction of the power needed to create the realms. To become all-powerful, Onaga must discover a way to fuse them into a single ultimate Kamidogu. 
I have been a pawn in Onaga's scheme to rule all. If I am to redeem myself, I must continue to learn all that I can and prepare for this final battle against the Dragon King. My journey is far from over. Round one, fight! <laughs> So that I would be able to defend myself during the quest to find the Kami Dogu, Onaga had given me the power to absorb the fighting ability of any warrior I encountered. But his gift would prove to be his undoing. The warriors in Outworld were in disarray. Heroes were not focused on the true threat of Onaga, and villains were unaware that they were bringing about their own destruction by serving him. I united them and in one moment absorbed their combined fighting power. I shattered each of the Kamidogu, the source of his invulnerability. This weakened Onaga, and I attacked him without mercy. His mortal form was no match for a combatant infused with the powers of so many warriors. The Dragon King was finally defeated. The realms will remain as they have since the beginning. <laughs> <laughs>